welcome back. Drinkers of distinction. Yes, we're still going. It's, you know, we're distinctive and it's what we do. There's the can, bonehead phased out. So that's where the black and white came from and had a 3D model which was different to that one. So it's a New England IBA. I was really hoping the camera would focus, but. Anyway, fuck it. Let's take the four. Yeah, pretty awards, but platinum and gold records won't bring back your soul. And that's true, but it's laying on the floor. You're crying or not because you said you fucking wanted more. Who'd want? Oh my god. I really hate that. I don't know why the cans do it. You go to pour, and it's just like. No, I'm a waterfall. I actually like to fucking spill everywhere. Well, it's a risk you take. Huh? There we go, that's better. It just means a slightly higher pour, that's all. But like I say, I've got a spill resistant keyboard, so it's not a major, massive deal. I just don't like wasting the beer. Look at that. So it's, it's a New England IPA, 6.5%. Bit of a blurb there, but we'll have a taste first. Oh, big fruit notes. Slightly dry, which what you would use, what you would expect from a New England IPA. Mmm. Mmm. That's really juicy. It's juicy and sweet. Well balanced. That's really, really nice. That is really, really nice. It's right around a little busy but we think all opinions can amount to be challenged what you might be unsure of today could turn out to be something special even if bonehead and give yourself another day to consider things. This hazy neeper is our reminder to look in with what we know from time to time with fresh insight and innovation because to Last forever, you can't be not in touch. Fucking good drop. I'm having a little bit of trouble seeing. The writing's a bit small. Tropical, nolon, pineapple, and stone fruit. Definitely true. Juicy. Sweet fruit, melon, pineapple, and stone fruit, balanced with a little bitterness. Well, that's why I was saying, you know, you could taste the fruit, you could taste the bitterness. Wasn't too much of anything. It's really well balanced. It's really sweet. It's, but not sugary sweet. It's really nice. Holoborn, Octron, 216. Two bombshells, I think that's it. Decide to open an independent brewery that outlives their. Oh, fuck, I can't, I can't see it. Anyway, fucking top drop. 
Really top drop. Look at that. Pours like a hazy. It's it's really juicy. Oh, look at that. Cloudy as you like. That's how it should be. Beautiful. And this had a hazy. It's a New England IPA. And this is what I mean. Yeah, some beers might have char characteristics of others. But I ain't calling it unless I'm actually seeing it, you know? But hey, I ain't no expert. But yeah, fucking bonehead, mate. They make nothing bad. See, look at that. Beautiful focus. Phased out New England IPA. Beautiful. Ah. Chin Chin. Oh, yeah. That's beautiful. That is gorgeous. Hmm. Very, very, very well balanced. Clean. And this is what I mean. You get that slight bit of this kick, but it's not enough that's going to make you gag. You know? It's very well balanced. It's, oh, it's so good. So good. So get amongst it if you can get it. Phase out by Bonehead. Juicy, well balanced, not dry, not bitter. Just chef's kiss, gorgeous. So uh, take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and as usual, may all your shenanigans be innocent, because no one likes to get caught doing the wrong thing now, do they? <laughs> all right. Take care, and uh, I'll see you when I'm looking at you. All right? See you.